news for you all this morning. The temperatures, of course, are one of the top stories. We're used to this weather, but Aroostook Emergency Management Agency still has some advice on staying safe during these frigid temperatures. Here again, Rianne Lowndes. The temperature is expected to drop, and Darren Woods, director of Aroostook Emergency Management Agency, says even county folk need to keep some cold weather safety tips in mind. The things that we constantly are concerned with is what if um, something occurs to the power grid and um, people are without power. Wood says in the event that you experience an outage, just be prepared with blankets and keep in touch with your town or city as they may set up a warning center for those in need. When heating your home, be sure to use your heaters properly. So it's important for people to understand that you can't run a, a, a gas fire for example, uh, like a, something with a motor inside your home without proper ventilation. You also, for uh, electric space heaters, we wanna make sure we have a good three foot distance all around them. Uh, make sure that we're not um, setting devices uh, on or near things like mattresses, pillows, or blankets. Um, have a good, give them some space. Any heater you're using should be plugged directly into the wall because inadequate extension cords could catch fire, says Woods. And be sure to have functional smoke detectors and fire extinguishers in your home. Finally, be aware of signs that you're getting too cold. Make sure that you understand the signs of hypothermia, the shivering, the exhaustion, confusion, such as things like that. Aroostook Emergency Management Agency recommends minimizing your time outside in negative degree temperatures. If you need more information, Wood says to visit ready.gov for winter weather safety tips. Brian Lowndes, News Source 8.